India A, which has been officially launched by HMD Global in India for 36,999 Indian rupees. It will be available from 14 October in India, both online and offline. In online segment, you can buy it from Amazon.in exclusively. In this video, we are going to share our first impressions and a quick hands-on overview of the smartphone. So let's get started. Talking first about the design and build quality, it will be available in different colors and finishes. The one we have with us is the polished blue color. You can also get it in glossy polished copper or the matte tempered blue or still finished look. It has IP54 rated, which means it is splash proof. You get main ports or buttons on the bottom side. Right side, you have the power key and the volume rocker on the top, a 3.5 mm audio jack, and on the left side, you have the SIM card tray. On the back, you get this dual 13 megapixel camera placement and it has the Z's branding as well. This is 13 plus 13 f2.0 cameras with laser and phase detection autofocus. It also has OIS and dual LED flash. In the front, you get again a 13 megapixel camera. Then you have a 5.3 inch IPS LCD display, which has a resolution of 1440 into 2560 pixels and it is being protected by Corning Gorilla Glass 5. Below that, you have a fingerprint sensor and a multitasking and a back button. Overall, in terms of design and build quality, the smartphone looks really good. The back does attract fingerprints, but it is comfortable to hold and feels really good in hand. In terms of performance, you get Snapdragon 835 with 4GB of RAM on this device and 64GB of storage. Out of 64GB, you roughly get around 50GB free on this particular smartphone and it runs on Android 7.0 out of the box. And it can handle multitasking with these and gaming with ease as well 835 is a powerful processor you won't be facing any issues and since it's a stock android experience there is no blotware installed on the device now let's come to the camera the main feature with the company is highlighting is this bothy feature which can be used to simultaneously capture video or photos from the front and the back camera not only that you can live stream on platforms like youtube directly from the front and back camera simultaneously at the same time which is an interesting feature and might help in um, scenarios where you want to vlog about particular location and you want to be in that vlog the image quality seems to be nice both from the front and the back camera the back camera seems to work really nice the images have good color reproduction and details we will be talking more about these things later on now coming to some other features it has nokia ozo audio which will help you in capturing great quality audio on this particular device as mentioned it is ip54 rated then you also get a 3090 mh battery it does support fast charging that is quick charge 3.0 has a fingerprint sensor which works really well so overall at 37,000, it seems to be a nice product from the company which will compete with devices like oneplus 5 and the flagship products like samsung galaxy s8 and iphone 7 or now the new iphone 8 but we will be doing a detailed review very soon as of now the main highlights of this device is the design a great display powerful specifications and the booty feature also ozo sound seems to be really interesting we will be recording a lot of stuff using this device and we'll share the sample soon thanks for watching have a nice day